So this is the K10 Max drone. Let's check it out. What's up everybody? Welcome to Drone Mania. Disclaimers, my friends, this is not a sponsored video. I purchased this with my own money. So you can guarantee you'll be receiving the utmost honest opinion and review of this product. So let's get started with the K10 Max drone. By unboxing our lunchbox, I mean our uh, carrying box of the drone. <laughs> Here you have your user manual, basically tells you how to insert the batteries, how to fly the drone, etc. Basic functions. And here you have the little manual flip, pan flip, downloading the app, some functions, etc. And in here you have the standard, like on all toy grade drones, your little package with multiple things, like your charging cable which in this case is a micro naturally they're most of the time they come in a micro and not type c you have your propeller guards you have your spare propellers if you can see them right there you see spare propellers and you have in here right there your phillips screwdriver then we go with the controller put that aside here's the controller you just flip this up power button right there, power buttons gauge, and through the stuff right here. On the top sides, on the left first, you have your speed rate, and then you have your headless mode. And here on the right, you have your 360 degree flip, and you have your return to home, which is not really return to home. It's just the same as pressing backwards but this is automatic very standard and basic stuff i wouldn't recommend using that then right here you have as you can see this logo right here that is your obstacle avoidance because the drone has four-way obstacle avoidance so that's the button right there here you have up down because it controls the camera's gratitude how it goes up and down it's uh, it's mechanical so it can go up and down from these buttons right here you have your takeoff and landing and here you have your trims depending when you're flying where you're flying if the drone drifts this is your best friend right here and that's pretty much it on the back real quick we just open it already i pre-installed three double a batteries that's pretty much it for the controller my friends let's get on to the drone so here is the drone as you can see let's just open it up real quick it's hard to do it with one hand but i'm managing pretty well there you go so this is how it looks fully opened up next to a phone or a flip phone that's how big it is let's open the phone so you can get an idea of its size it's basically a lot smaller than the phone very lightweight no although there is a tiny bit weight but generally for toy grade drones they're all the same very lightweight it has three cameras so they say very similar to what the X6 Max drone has. It has a three camera, but does not really have three cameras. Let's see if this piece of crap has three camera cameras, which I doubt. Right there, it says in beautiful K10 Max 3 HD camera. So they even advertise it, but we'll really find out real quick if that is true. So make sure to continue watching to find out. It has also four obstacle avoiding directions, which if I'm not mistaken, they will only work really in uh, closed areas, not in sun. There isn't so much sun out today, so it might work, but infrared usually doesn't work when there is sun. So we'll test that out. Let's check out the battery. 
So here is the battery. Let's see if I can zoom it in. Okay, zoomed in, 3.7 volt, 1800 milliamp battery. How long we get? Uh, from what I know, they said about uh, 18 minutes, if I'm not mistaken, but naturally, we'll be lucky if we get five to six minutes. So we'll be testing that out to really see the truth. So we're all set. Let's set it up real quick and get into the flight, my friends. See how well it does. Let's just real quick check out the gusts of wings, how strong they are. So you can see about 10 kilometers, nine kilometers, 10 kilometers. So there is wings when we turn it around, it does naturally drop. There it is, two, five, six, seven. Oh, it's going up, there it is. So about 10 kilometer wings. Okay, my friends, so I have been trying already for the past 10 minutes to try to connect this piece of crap K10 Max drone to the freaking app. Now, if you know my channel, I know how to connect the two together. Unless some totally new thing is happening, I have no idea, but nothing is working. Nothing is connecting. It could be that I have a disabled drone in this case, or the camera, or the Wi-Fi connection of the camera that it takes out is is defected but i cannot connect to it at all so in my opinion this already to me is a really red flag but we will still continue the video and see how well its flight at least is and i will be contacting the seller to inform him of this so he knows what's going on and or he'll try to explain to me something which I already know and I've done a million times or I will be sent a new one I have no idea but let's continue the video so you'll at least be able to see the flight in about 10 kilometer winds of speed I really apologize for this and I uh, hope you are still tuning into the video at least here is the terrible crappy drone let's take off you can either press this button right here to take off or you just press up and the motors will start like so motors starting down motors power off. but let's take it off so there is wind but wow he is really holding its position you can see how he's fighting. You can see how he's fighting the winds and he's holding his position. I'm pretty impressed with that. That is really badass. That is really badass. I would assume that it would be moving left and right and etc., going crazy, but it's holding. So that is a very, very good sign. First time I've seen a drone hold its position that well in these types of winds. So let's fly it. This is on its first rate of speed, so it is very slow. Now it's on its second rate. As you can see, it's moving a little faster. Let's go to its third rate. Now a third rate. Oh yeah, now it's flying. You'll see it coming now faster. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty fast. That's pretty good. Let's see if it's drifting. Look at that, no drift, basic. Okay, there it is, it's starting to drift, yeah. No, still holding, it's pretty good, man. I will say I'm very impressed with the position it's holding. That is impressive. Let's check, uh, let's check out a flip, see how well it does a flip. <laughs> Cute flip. Oh my god, look at that. Look at it, look how it's loose. The obstacle avoidance. Look how it's loose. That's a real big no-no. Okay. Let's try another flip. Hopefully that shit won't come out. Front flip. Wow, nice front flip. I like that. Let's try back flip. Boom! 
pretty cool I like how the flips are how I like how the flips are going with this they look really nice left flip and that's all the flips it's a pretty good drone I have to whoa that was close it's a pretty good drone I have to admit in terms of how it flies I'm very impressed with its flight let's see how far it takes it wow that's pretty far and it's going wow that is amazing I have to admit my friends this is a real badass drone in terms of flight wow look how it's holding its position turning its yaw on third rate is pretty fast not so bad let's uh work it i don't have really some sort of wall or something let's uh, see if i can test it out i'll try so i'm pressing the button to turn on the obstacle avoidance okay let's see if it crashes to me I pressed uh, throttle up instead of forward. Wow. Let's see me out of the way. Okay, so nothing is working. Let's take that out. Okay, everything is working now. Let's try that again okay so for some reason outside i think maybe the sun or something is driving crazy the infrared because as you can see it is not moving nothing you see no forward no back ah back slowly wait let's take it back let's see if it does something you see it's going crazy i guess from the sunlight it's thinking that there's some sort of obstacle in front of it which there isn't nothing but i'm guessing because of the sunlight it's driving it crazy so yeah so that's something that can only be used indoors let's see how the battery is nothing is flashing battery is still going strong i'm pretty impressed with this wow it's working pretty freaking good i'm really really disappointed that the stupid camera is not working really disappointed in that oh my god you guys don't know how disappointed and upset i am that my camera is not connecting and it's like the same almost all the time 99% of the time with toy gray drones it's always the same procedure to connect between the phone to the camera's drone as you've seen in all my videos of shorts if you notice that so it is a real bummer that it is not working in this case which gives me the idea that I have a defected camera connection whatever you want to call it some sort of interference some sort of a dis defect i have no idea why it's not working but yeah like i said i'm gonna call i'm gonna message them and ask them but wow the battery is holding pretty good there it is there it is let's bring it here before it drops as you can see hopefully i got this in the shot the battery is a flat it's giving the flashing and here it is gonna stop gonna stop boom look at that it's getting weak there it is and it's done so how long was that flight seven minutes eight minutes something like that so naturally what they say is a complete horse manure or horse crap whichever of the two you prefer to hear I like both of them so that's why I said both of them 
so yeah my friends that's pretty much it for this uh, video I'm very very disappointed that the camera did not work so in my opinion if you buy this drone and the camera will work and you can guarantee somehow that you'll receive a working camera whether it's a low quality or not I would recommend getting it for the flight it has a really beautiful flight but other than that nothing too special in my case first impressions I would not say I recommend this drone because of first impressions but depends how you get lucked out on it I got lucked out pretty bad so I am giving this a hell no terms of first impressions but I have to make an argument that the flight was pretty badass that's pretty much it for this uh, video my friends I hope this video helped you out I hope it gave you some insight and understanding of this drone and a first impression of what I received till next time my friends remember to be safe take care have fun and peace out people Bam.